Hello everybody, this is Chris Nelson at Go Engineer, and in today's video we will be learning how to use the different mirroring options while creating sketches. So right now I have an open sketch that has a rectangle and a construction line going right down the center. And if we want to do a basic mirror, all we need to do is create something on one side of the boundary line. So I have a circle right here. And if we go up here to this mirror entities option, then we need to click in the entities mirror box and choose whatever we want to mirror. And then what we want to mirror about. So I've selected this construction line and you can see this yellow circle shows what it will look like afterwards. When I click okay, it will move the circle from the left side over to the right side reflecting across that axis. Alternatively, we can, if we go back and we redo this mirror entities. If we check this box right here to copy, it will keep a copy of the original circle and copy it to the other side. So now we have two circles. This is the mirror entities tool, but we also have the dynamic mirror entities tool, which I have right here in my toolbar. By default, it is not in the sketch toolbar, but in order to enable it, press the S key on your keyboard and right click on the toolbar that pops up. After clicking the customize button, come down to the sketch button on the toolbar dropdown. You will then see this icon that is mirror with a lightning bolt. If you double click that, drag it up onto your sketch toolbar and it will be there to use. Once you've done that, click the dynamic mirror entities tool and you need to decide the line you would like to mirror about. I'm going to use the same construction line. Now that it has been selected, whenever you draw anything in a sketch with it enabled, it will automatically update the geometry on the other side of the axis. This is very useful for quickly creating mirrored entities. I hope with these two tools you'll be able to better create sketches. I hope you found the SOLIDWORKS tutorial video useful. If you would like to continue improving your skills in SOLIDWORKS, enroll in one of our online training courses at Go Engineer.